welcome back to Vivax. I hope you have a wonderful day. Well, this is uh, the Vampire Diaries season one, episode seven. Here we go. Everyone's looking for oh, you. Oh, she's a vampire now. What's wrong, Vip? I'm so cold. Those kids the that were killed. Stone vampire. What did you see? It's interesting to be honest. <laughs> No, it won't go away. Just kill him and what kill yourself. Um, what drugs did you take? I'm so hungry, Tom. Shouldn't you be going to school? Are you kidding me, right? You shouldn't skip school. If they find her, we'll know. That's what cell phones are for. Y your lips keep moving. I don't know why. <laughs> okay. Hey, um, I'm hungry. Do you have anything to eat? Like, are they a trio now? Because I'm not liking this. What is it? Yeah, what is it? Is it skunk? St. Bernard? Bambi? Go on, give it a try. She's new. <laughs> she needs people blood. She can't sustain on that stuff. Mm, yeah, why can't I have people blood? Yeah, because it's wrong to prey on innocent people, Vicky. You don't have to kill to feed. Just find someone. It's so easy. <laughs> no, no, no. There's no guarantee that you can control yourself, okay? It takes years to learn that. You could easily kill somebody, and then you have to carry that with you for the rest of your life. I say snatch, eat, erase. Hey, Snatch, look at me. Right. Don't smirk at me like that. Is Stefan here? Yep. Where is he? And yep. good morning to you, little miss. I'm on a mission. If you wanted me dead, I'd be dead. Yes, you would. But I'm not. Yet. Oh my god, I'm enjoying this Where so Stephen? much. It just makes my life just better. She's a drug user. I mean, all that's gonna play part in how she responds to this. So she's okay. a vampire with issues? What am I supposed to do? Because I am lying to everyone that I care about. What's gonna happen to her? I'm gonna keep her here with me. Our ancestors lived in secrecy for over 100 years. It's important that we still do. Grams, everybody knows you're a witch. <laughs> they also... You've been talking history for two days. I wanna get to the fun part. It's not meant to be fun. It's real and it's serious. Finally, someone Aren't you that to knows stuff. Are we in danger? I mean, if it found the watch, then it knows we know. And could it come after us? And, and should I even be saying it? Or is it, or is it a he or a she? So they yes, we like... very much be in danger. So what do we do? Just keep it quiet. Two gorgeous yeah, people. Yeah, the entire this. Hey, have you seen Elena? Maybe she's with Stefan. Riding to his castle on his white horse. Oh, don't be bitter. It provokes wrinkles. <laughs> I love Coffee is our friend. It's the caffeine. It circulates through our veins and it warms our body, so we're not so cold to okay. the touch. Well, what if I want to drink human blood? You're gonna have to learn to live with that urge. It can work. It's your choice, Vicky. So you've never tasted human blood? Not in a long time. <sighs> I need more blood. Where's your bathroom? I have to pee. Why do I have to pee? I thought I was dead. Yeah. Do they need to be? Are we They're good? like practically dead. Interesting. All I'm saying is Jeremy is not getting involved in any of this. Can someone please kill Vicky? I mean it, Vicky. Or I would die oh, if she would not. She's on edge. Imagine every sense in your body operating at super speed. I mean, she's uncomfortable in her own skin, and then when you throw in her other issues. How long before it settles? Hours, days, weeks? There's no rule book. It's difficult to separate your feelings. Love, lust, anger, desire can all blur into one urge. Hunger. I'm not gonna let anybody get hurt. I need to get going. Something come out good. Of what are you doing? Vicky turned into a vampire. We are the next hundred laughing. years. Why did you do it? I was bored. bored. I knew it. <laughs> I knew it. Anything else? Don't what is it about? Don't tell me that I'm going to be like a thing. Just been no. cooped up all day. Somehow Damon's idea always bad. <laughs> uh, <laughs> my bad. <laughs> she will not be able to like go to her home. It's like an okay. invisible wall or something. You gotta call me, Vic. I don't get it. What's going on with you? Just. Jeremy, me, please. Do you love her? I, I want to know why, but I can't see it. I want to see it, but I can't. For months after mom and dad died, I felt like crap. Like, nothing really even mattered, crap. And all of a sudden, I'd get these moments, and things started to feel just a little bit better, and Vicky was in every single one of them. So okay. you may not see it, but trust me. I'm keeping me away from her is not for the best. 
I am going to drink until someone is hot enough to make out with. Sounds like a plan. How many martinis have you had? Oh, don't uh, it's why you dressed up as a witch? Can we go now? No, we'll let <laughs> Let me guess. Daisy Buchanan. I love a good Whoa. Gatsby look. It's Damon, right? No, oh, you remember. Oh, you have a face that's hard to forget. Totally right. But if it's about the Vervain. You know about the Vervain? Well, I'm a Salvatore. Smart. Of course I do. Really? Mm-hmm. No headache. Your stomach's not screaming at you. You're not feeling lightheaded or anxious or cranky. Like if someone looks at you the wrong way, you could just rip their head off. Do you know what that's called? It's called hunger. And it's only going to get worse and worse Memphis every minute that you pretend ways, like it's not like controlling hunger. you. You know what? I am so late. My husband is not going to be happy with me. Really? Well, are you happy with your husband? <sighs> You're flirting with me. You flirted with me first. True. <laughs> <laughs> oh, well, we had the founder's party, and anyone who arrived during the day was eliminated as a suspect. Oh. And all the rest were just dead ends. Oh! Mm. 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 You see? It's good on? to be handsome. Hey, I'd like it back, please. I'm not giving it to you. I'll give it to Caroline and she can give it to you if she feels like it. Or I could just take it right now. What just happened? I was so worried about you. I'm fine now, but I gotta leave. Ow! Oh my god. A little too far. <laughs> this is giving me anxiety. Wow, Elena. Go. Get inside. Go! Is she dead? Vicky! Hmm? Vicky! 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 She won't like go Vicky! Vicky! and disappear. She's all like veiny and this is your what? fault, Damon. Well, I'm happy about her because she's dead now, but I kind of feel like sorry. For Jeremy mostly. And Matt also. Oh, oh Matt, poor oh, Matt. You did this. This is your fault. Yeah. yeah. Elena, don't do it. Elena. People die around you. How could it not matter? It matters and you know it. <gasps> Elena? He's holding himself. You know, I, I can't find Vicky. She totally bailed on me. Mm. I don't know where she is. Is this what I'm in for? A lifetime of worrying about her? Oh my god. Okay, I'm sorry. I, I feel sorry now. I You're a good brother, sorry. Matt. I didn't think about the consequences of her being dead. Like, for Elena to have to lie to Matt and for Matt to like think that his sister bailed on him. And oh god. So I did not go to tell him that she's dead? I don't understand. I mean, I know what I saw, but. I don't understand. Now she's dead. Vicky's dead. Oh. I can't stop it. Her. Shh. It's okay. Yeah. It's okay. Why does everybody have to die on me? Oh, oh Stephen, be so, so sorry. Wrong, this wasn't your fault. Baby. It wasn't your fault. So they will not tell him that she's dead. Oh. This is even worse. I never thought I'm gonna cry because of Ricky's okay. death. I, uh, I wanted to help her. I know. But instead, um... <sighs> Stefan! Can you make him forget? Elena. Stefan, please. I don't know how he'll ever get past this. I, I just want him to forget him everything that happened. If I did it, there's no guarantee that it would work. Yeah. I can do it. 
Does Damon have like a heart? Do you do you do you get what I want? Oh, then he knows that it's his fault and he wanted what to you make want? him fight. Why though? Why? I want you to tell to him. Then Vicky left say. town. So let's break down this episode. We'll start with the ending. Lena's decision. Some of you will agree and some of you will disagree. Well, it's not right, obviously, to take this choice from him. But in this case, I agree with Elena. Because, first of all, Jeremy is still young. He, has, he is 15 now. I don't know if Elena is... I think she is 17 or 18. And Jeremy is like 15. Jeremy find it so hard after his parents died he was a messed up kid he said it himself he felt like crap since his parents died and the only escape that he had from his life is vicky so i can tell already that vicky's death well messes him up even further like I don't think that he can go back to normal from this like because he feels like everyone dies on him like his parents, the girl that he loved so imagine how this is going to be for him it's going to be like so 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 hard not just hard, I think this was going to break him down and the thing that makes me think like this is he just saw Vicky becoming like this monster that is trying to kill his sister but the only thing that he was looking at is the fact that Vicky is dead like Elena told him do you understand what happened and he said I don't understand I saw what happened like he saw that Vicky is like this monster that is trying to kill him and kill his sister but it doesn't matter to him or it matters to him that Vicky is dead so that should tell you something this is why i i agree with elena she did it for her brother and he needed it you can agree or disagree but this is how i see things this is how i feel in the moment uh damon for elena to confront damon like this i think he would have killed her if she was not elena that should tell you something and the fact that i don't know did he did this because he knows deep down that it's his fault and he should make it right but this is damon who we're talking about like he didn't have to help maybe this the time when elena like told him like people are dying around you and it matters triggered something in him i don't know because she was like she was like trying to make him see things or did he do it for elena or both he did it for elena and because he knows this is his fault like tell me when at the time when you first watched this scene what did you think did you think this is Damon doing this for Elena or this is Damon doing this for him because he regret doing what he did to Vicky? And and the thing that I liked in the scene when Damon told Elena like I I'm going to do it for for you. I'm going to like uh, take away his memories. He she looked at Stefan and told him I want him to think that and that and that. He she didn't like she didn't like look at Damon and told him, she looked at Stefan. She wasn't like acknowledging the fact that Damon is helping her. She was like looking at Stefan. <laughs> I don't know, but I like this scene. Um, and I kind of feel sorry for Elena. The thing is, she wanted the most after her parents died is to feel normal again, to go back to normal again. And to know that she is like now caught in this crazy world. And knowing that somehow she has to deal with this, uh, even if she doesn't want to be with Stephanie, it's like, I kind of feel bad for her. It's, she all, all that she wants is to be normal. It's like to go back to this normal life, like before her parents died. And it's kind of bad. 
Bonnie and Damon. Damon wanted this necklace, and uh, like she, she, is she did. Did she the one that did this? Like shocked him when he wanted to steal the necklace, or was the necklace itself? I don't know. But he definitely like was shocked. Like he didn't expect that, and. Uh, Apparently this necklace belonged to her like great 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 grandmother and and the photo was like 1864 so I'm assuming she will like have a role in this her ancestor is like has to do with Damon's plan or something we learned a lot by seeing like um, uh what's her name I already forgot what her name Vicky Vicky's transformation and like how the vampire mechanism work <laughs> i don't know how to say <laughs> like even if i didn't like vicky but the, her story was like major one uh in order to explain the plot and the way like they introduce us to the storyline it's amazing i don't feel like this is like a vampire teen show at all i feel like it's more realistic the storyline is really really good written with Vicky. We understood how the mind control thing worked. You told me that it's called compulsion in this uh, universe. We learned how like uh, first how you uh, you become a vampire. You have to have a, bl a vampire blood in your, in your system and die and afterwards like feed that human blood. Um, we learned how Damon is good at compulsion than, than Stefan because Stefan doesn't drink human blood so he um, he can do it but he can do it right like not for long term I think not like Damon and afterwards they showed us how being a vampire like uh, it's like depending on your personality that I found so intriguing like for instance like Vicky is like an impulsive uh, drug user and that like all of that will have like a part in how she responds to this and we learned about the fact that your emotions while being a vampire is like on edge I don't know if this is only when we are uh, in the beginning of your transformation or does it like carry on with you like for a long time for like a a good amount of time we learned that uh, your emotions becomes on edge you can separate your feelings you like you can separate love uh, anger desire hunger and that like hunger manifests in a lot of ways emotionally and physically and it's so so intriguing by the way it's so so good i really really wish for them to like introduce us to this a new vampire mythology, new vampire folklore. It's gonna be so interesting if they do that. Just look, explore, like I want them to explore this universe as much as they can. In this universe, you 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 have a lot of story to tell. You can run out of storyline. <laughs> I, I don't think so. And I, uh, you can see the difference be between Damon and Stefan and the way they wanted to mentor like Vicky. Damon's like just accept your vampire part. This is how it should be. You need to, to you you have to and you need to drink human blood. You don't have to like kill just to erase their memory. But Stefan, Stefan is like looking at it in another way. No one can tell for sure that she won't hurt anyone. He was right after all. She has no control of it whatsoever he wanted to like teach her how to uh, adapt his diet as much as i was agreeing with stefan i knew that she is not the person to teach her that she will not like she will not she won't go in that diet and like she's like more like damon if you think about it this way she's the one that will enjoy being a vampire Pretty much like Damon. They're both impulsive. And I was like, don't tire yourself, Stephanie, you're teaching her in vain. We learned a little bit about uh, Bonnie's family and that her family uh, came from Salem. We know that already, she told Stefan. And that they killed her family. So 
we can assume that people knowing about witches is going to end up bad really really need to be discreet Damon in his Damon way <laughs> he learns stuff about this council and they're like a group of vampire hunters or something and they need Vervain and he and he oddly will supply them at least he knows that they don't know that they that vampire can vampires can walk in the starlight is it for all vampires or it's only specific for Damon and Stefan this is a question so I think that's it it was a really really good episode I loved it thank you guys for watching if you enjoyed my reaction see you in another video please don't forget to comment like and subscribe and share with your friends if you love my reaction and if you want to see uh, uncut reactions go ahead and watch them on my patreon goodbye